Today on Daily in the Word, we see a beautiful picture of God's authority over the enemy and his power over sin. In the prophetic vision of Zechariah chapter 3, we're told that the high priest is standing before the angel of the Lord, but the accuser, Satan, is there too. Satan, true to his name, is making accusations against the high priest, Joshua, and rightly so. No high priest would perform his priestly services in dirty clothes. But Joshua's clothes were more than just dirty. The word filthy used here is the strongest expression in the Hebrew language of filth of the most vile nature. A better translation might be sinfully filthy clothing. And for a priest to do this would have been blasphemous. So what does the Lord do? First, he exercises authority over Satan by saying, The Lord rebuke you, Satan. And here's the context. Satan must have been pointing to Joshua's filthy clothes and declaring that Joshua was was unfit for service. But the Lord cut him off and shut him down. Now, keep in mind, this is a being whose very name identifies him as an adversary. But he immediately submitted to the voice of the Lord. Satan taken care of, the Lord turns his attention to his servant Joshua, and he cleans him up. Take away the filthy, sinful garments from him, the Lord said. And then to Joshua, see, I have removed your iniquity from you, and I will clothe you with rich robes. So here's the thing. We all have an enemy, an adversary that accuses us and consistently exposes our weaknesses to us. But more important than that, we all have a Savior who fights our battles for us and cleanses us from all unrighteousness. His name is Jesus.